I was working as a project engineer in the group prior to Cryo. I was from the electronics background. I was looking for some opportunities in software development and I saw that Cryo had some great projects to showcase. When I saw the Cryo portfolio, I really liked the things that we would be doing in Cryo, like building some great projects over here. The modules that were presented, it's like how someone from a team lead would give you the task to do that was very similar to what we would do on a real job. The projects, they do obviously add some value to your resume. For your resume to get shortlisted, it's important you make your resume in a structured manner. The articles and the blogs presented that really help that what we should be presenting in our resume. Apart from projects also, it's very necessary that you develop problem solving skills. I found that DSA modules were also very important in solving those problems. In most of the DSA problems, I found that the checklist and the follow up list that were given at the bottom of the question that really helped in building up the thought process in how we would be approaching the problem. I would suggest that first build out things and see first of all if you really like it or not. Try to build some good projects that really helped me to make the resume the way that I wanted.